Hey guys, Kirk from Force Induction NHL is here. I want to introduce you to our 5th gen Camaro plug and play kit. What we've got here is CNC fittings and they plug directly into the AC system. We pre-make all of the hoses for you, so it's simply a true bolt-on kit. Mounting bracket so you can mount the chiller, insulation, dryer, bracket, bolts, solenoid. This solenoid here, what this does, is this physically blocks the flow of refrigerant to the cabin. So you've got on-off control of whether you can run the system as cabin and chiller or chiller only. You control that by this simple on-off switch here. So essentially what you would do is when you want to race, put it in chiller only mode, or when it's winter time, put it in chiller only mode, set that cabin temperature to whatever you want it to be. It'll be nice and cold in the chiller and nice and warm inside the car. So as you can see, everything's pre-made for you comes with stickers, free t-shirt, most importantly here is this USB stick. On this stick comes step-by-step -step photo and video instructions. Simply follow along, put this on. What we've got here is optional AN12 push lock water fitting. So essentially you can push a three quarter inch rubber hose on there. And that goes onto your water ports here on the chiller. These are optional guys because you might want to run braided hose or we give you the option to just run rubber hose. Now over here is our 10 millimetre LSA lid spacer, strongly recommended for the LSA platform. This will isolate the intercooler brick from the supercharger, so there's less heat going up into the intercooler, into the brick itself. And then the spacer will aid for additional airflow to those restricted rear cylinders. All in all, really nice kit, very easy to put on, especially because we've done everything for you. Just bolt it all on, away you go. All right, this one's fitted with the stage two chiller. As you can see, we get down there, you can make out, you know, some brackets and the dryer. That's really about it when you sort of get right down. But if you're at a normal level, you can't see anything. All right, guys, 103 degree day, really hot. So we've pulled it into the, into the garage here. 26.7 degree. Still extremely humid outside. 